Okay, doctor is one of eight. Unmute your microphone. Asatu Asatul Wahidatu Asatul Saniatu Asatus Saniatu Asatus Saniatu Asatus Salisatu Asatur Rabiatu Asatul Hamisatu Asatus Sadisatu Asatus Sabiatu Asatus Saminatu Asatu Tasiatu Asatul Ashiratu Asatul Hadi Yata Ashratu Asatu Saniatu Ashratu Here we have Satul Hadiatu. We have the Maher Atadribul Awul Ursum Akari Basati Mihas Bilwak Til Matulu. He's asking you to draw Ursum in draw. The needles of the clock or hands of the clock according to the required time. So here time required is 12, 12 o'clock. So you will draw the needles or hands according to 12 o'clock. Here you would draw the needles according to 5 o'clock. Here you will draw the hands according to 2 o'clock. So you will, you will draw these here. It is your homework. Hasab mean according to. Bihasbi according to. Bihasbi. Anyone else? According to. Then we have Atadribu Samin. Atadribu Sani. Second exercise. Umzurila Sati wa Kulil Wakta. Look at the clock and tell the time. So who oh, raise your hand? Raise your hand. Okay, Satya, tell me the time in these pictures. 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Uh, Asatu Saniyatu Ashuratu. Asatu Saniyatu. Okay. Huh? Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, then, 5 o'clock. First exercise. Exchange the questions and answer with your colleague, like the one in example. Al Misal, a talibul awal, kamsa tanta malu fil yom. How many hours do you work in the day? Amalu samaniya saatin fil yom. I work eight hours in the day. So here with the time number you will use kitab because it is telling us about the time of the verb. 
so will you will use fatah with all of them after the word come next word should be singular mansub so it should be singular and it should have fatah that's why sa is singular and it has fatah from then we use plural so that's why we are using saat we are using plural word here so raise your hand so why kasra on saatin because from 3 to 10 the number uh, anything which is counted from 3 to 10 should have kasra because it is muzafile it should be in mujrul state raise your hand okay dr rizwana you are first and satya you are second Doctor is one on mute your microphone. Come, Saat, come, Saatu, come, Samalu, come, Satan, Samalu, Filiomi. Amalo, Amalo, Samani, Amalo, Samani, Saatin, Filio, Samani, ya. It has fatah oh, because uh -huh. it's telling us about the time of the verb. Samani. Amalu samaniya saatin filiyao. Kam saatan tamalu filiyao mi. Then three hours. Amalu. Listen, this is not three o'clock, this is three hours. Okay, so yeah. for three hours, we use three, not three o'clock. So you use simple counting. Yes, Amalu. Salasa Satin Filion Amalu Amalu Salasa Satin Filion. I work three hours in a day. Come Satan Tamalu Filioni Amalu Amalu Arba Satin Filioni. Uh, I work four hours in a day. Should I continue, sir? Yes, continue. Kam satan tamalu filiomi. Amalu kam sa saatin filiomi. I work five hours in a day. Doctor is one. Satan. Yes, sir. Are you medical Satan. or PhD doctor? No, I'm a medical. I'm MD, sir. Internal medicine. I'm a specialist in internal medicine. Alhamdulillah. Okay, mashallah. Ask question. Kam Satan Tamalu Filiomi. Amalu Sita Saatin Filiaomi. No, I work your first student. Uh, okay, yes. I'm the first student. Kam Saatin Yamalu Filiaomi. Amalu Sawa Saatin Filiaomi. Amalu Samania Satin Filiomi Kam Satan Tamalu Filiomi Amalu Tisa Satin Filiomi 
Kanta atin tah malu filiaw mi? Amalu. Asyara sa atin filiaw mi. Itadayin mo sa ni second exercise. Tabadali suwala wal jawaba ma sa mili kakamakal misal. Al misal, at talibu lawal kam tiflan laka how many children do you have? At talibu sa ni li khamsatu at falin I have five children. So the word after the word "come" should be singular, and it should have "fata." That's why we are using singular word here, and it has "fata." Then, from three to ten, we use plural word. That's why we are using plural word here at "fal." And from three to ten, we also use "kasra." So that's why it is a plural word with "kasra." So, tifl is a masculine word, so we will use masculine counting here. Khamsatu, salasatu, arbatu, as you have already learned that, it is masculine counting. Laka, you have, li, I have. Raise your hand. Uh, excuse me, sir. Yes. Uh, I have the same question. Uh, the Miss I have. Uh, why we uh, consider only three to ten? Why don't we consider it two to ten? Because two also plural. No? For one and two, the rule is separate. From three to ten, rule is separate. From for eleven and twelve, rule is separate. From 13 to 9, 13 to 20, rule is separate. From 21 to 99, rule is separate. For 100, rule is separate. For 1000, rule is separate. So all these are separate rules that we need to memorize one by one. So at the moment, you all will memorize one rule and that rule is this, from three to 10, the number we the word we will use in plural form and it should have kasra thank you i need two students raise your hand miss amin abdi hassan you are first student and miss aisha you are second student Wa alaikum as salam Wa alaikum as salam Wa alaikum Kam 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 tifla laka Li kam tatul atufal Kam tifla laka Li salasatun atufal Salasatu Salasatu atufal. Kam tifla laka? Li arba'atu atufal. Okay, should I be first? Second is then? Yes. Should I continue? Okay. She should be first and I'll be second. Miss Amin Abdi okay. Hassan, I can't hear you very well. Your sound is not clear. I think you have some internet problem. You are not hearing me? Your sound is not clear. Miss Aisha, can you hear can you hear her clearly? No, it's breaking. Yeah, there is a problem with Amin Abdi. I think maybe our internet problem or maybe our microphone problem. Anyone else who wants to read, raise her hand. Miss Rahma, okay. Do this dialogue again. Miss Rahma, you are first student and Miss Aisha is second student. Kam tifla laka li kam tatu atufal. Kam tifla laka li salasatu atufal. Kam tifla laka 
لاربعه اطفال Now, Miss Aisha, you are first student. Come to Flan Laka. Saba Atum at five. Lee Saba Atu at five. Lee Saba Atum at five. Come to Flan Laka. Lee Sama Niatum at five. Come to Flan Laka. Lee Tis Atum at five. If anyone has any question, she can ask me. Al Misal At Talib Lawal Mazata Malu. What do you do? A Malu Tabiban. I work as a doctor. <coughs> so here you will use the Mansu form, Fata form, because it is Maful object of the sentence. So whenever we use to fatta with masculine word we use an extra alif so you will also use an extra alif with mumari saidaliyan tayyaran mudarrisan mumaridan muhandisan muallimun tabiban you will use an extra alif with all of them so raise your hand miss rina you are first student and Mr. Rizwana, you are second. Okay. Maza Tamalu. Rizwana. Amalu. Amalu Tabiban. Maza Tamalu. Amalu. Muari Dun. Maza Tamalu. Amalu Saidaliyan. Maza Tamalu. Amalu Tayaran. Now, Rizwana, you are first student. Maza Tamalu. Amalu Mudarrisan. Maza Tamalu. Amalu Muhandisan. Maza Tamalu. Amalu Mualliman At the table, Rabbi Al Missal at Tolib Lowell Aina Tamalu. Where do you work? At Tolib Sani Amalu Fish Sharika. I work in the company. So the preposition fee gives Kastra to the next word. Raise your hand. Wa alaikum as -salam. Can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you. So, Ms. Amin Ali okay. Hassan, you are first student. And Ms. Satya, you are second student. Okay. Aina ta'amalu? Ahamalu fi sharikati. Aina ta'amalu? Ahmalu fil mustashfi. Fil mustashfa. Fi mustashfa? Yes. For fi is the. Aina ta'amalu? Yeah. I think they want to ask why we are not using kasra with mustashfa. So the reason is that here we have alif at the end. At the end of mustashfa, we have an alif maksura. So preposition does not give kasra to alif. That's why we are not using any kasra here. We will say amanu fil mustashfa. Amanu fil mustashfa. أين تعمل؟ أعمل في الجامعات. أين تعمل؟ أعمل في المكتبات. نعم ساتي يا فرست تونت. أين تعمل؟ أعمل في كلية. 
في كلية الديارات في كلية الديارات في كلية الديارات أين تعمل؟ أعمل في كلية المهندس في كلية الهندسة في كلية الهندسة أين تعمل؟ أعمل في كلية الصيادلة كلية الصيادلة سوري فين بلتي في كلية الصيدلة I can't hear you صيدلة Do you have any question? Oh. Do you have any question? No. Okay. في كلية الصيدلة in the faculty of pharmacy. Next, we'll start the next exercise next time, inshallah. Who wants to practice dialogue? Raise your hand. So Miss Serena and Miss Satya, you will do this dialogue. So the situation is this, the husband will come from outside. You will ask him, do you want to drink water? Do you want to eat something? And he will say that I want water, I want to eat some fruit. And then you will give him the fruit. So <clears throat> Miss Satya, your wife, and Miss Serena, your husband. Okay. okay. Uh, oh. Start the dialogue. Uh, am I or Serena? Look, when your husband will come to your house, you will not ask me that who will start the dialogue. You just okay, okay. So, Miss Rina is husband, she has opened the door, she has entered the room. Now it is up to you, both of you, how you will start the dialogue. I will uh, okay, you. so me, so me first. Okay, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Okay, let me, uh, let me ask you a question to all of you, okay? Whenever a husband okay. comes to house, whether he should greet the wife or whether wife should greet him? Why should husband, him? yes, <laughs> gets more so up. Okay, so you mean that Mr. Rizwana is saying that <laughs> husband should greet the wife first does yeah, because sir when we enter our uh, house we should do salam yes okay, yes good. i think so does everyone agree with this me even agree. if nobody is present we should do salam okay so mrs Rizwana is right when our husband entered the house he should greet everyone even if no one is in the house he should say assalamu alaikum to the creatures who don't see, okay? So Miss Rina will greet Satya. Start Assalamu again. alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Then. So what I must to say to her? Miss Satya will welcome you now. She will say ahlan wa sahlan. Oh, uh, ahlan wa sahlan. Okay. Mm. Now, Miss Satya will, you will sit and Miss Satya will ask you, do you want some water? Okay, now she will ask, do you want something to <coughs> eat? Uh, 
Tama, tama. Aturidu an taakula ay shay. Or you can say aturidu, aturidu al fakia. Do you want some food? Um, aturidu al fakia. Hmm. Naam aturidu fakia. You better specify a fruit. Uh, okay. Naam uridu inab. Naam uridu bazal inabi. Yes, I want some grapes. Okay. Okay. Naam uridu bazal inabi. No, Miss Satya will give you the fruit and water, and she will say, "Here it is the water," or "Here it is the grapes." Anyone else who wants to, okay, now Ms. Rina will say Jazakallahu Khairan. Anyone else who wants to do the dialogue? Jazakallahu Khairan. Raise your hand. I need two students. Okay, Dr. Rizwana and Ms. Rahma will do the dialogue. I'm entering. Yes, so Rizwana is husband and Rama is wife. Okay, sir. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Wa alaikum. I think there is Azan. Rizwana, so you better wait. Miss Amin Abdi Hassan, you are husband and Miss Rama is wife. Start again. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Wa alaikum. Maza turid. Wa alaikum salam. Maza turid. Uridul maa. Maza turid min al faqiat. Baada. Baada. Baada ina bi. Okay. Baada ina bi. Okay. Azihi ma wa inaba. Haza hu wal ma'u. Okay, haza. Okay, haza hu wal ma'u wa inaba. If anyone has any questions, she can ask me.